I just remember the first Asian American, or not Asian Canadian, actually, I think, that I saw in a movie. Action! Five on the set. With Sandra O oh in this movie called Guinevere, and she was so great. She wasn't the, Sarah Polly was the lead. And she just had like two scenes and she just killed it. She was so good. And I was like, yeah, go girl. I mean, it wasn't an actor, but on a screen, I remember seeing Christy Yamaguchi win the, uh, did she won the gold? I don't even remember. She won the uh, Olympics. She was just like her smile, like she was just so radiant. She was just so good at what she did. And like, I signed up for ice skating lessons. I quit pretty quickly, but I signed up because she was cool, and she was the first one I saw. Who's yours? For me? I'm, oh, you grew up I in grew Malaysia. Up in Asia, so That's right. I was, I was kind of surrounded by... But in cinema, it was it was something that... There was a hole. There was there was nothing sort of representative of that. But for me, growing up in, in Malaysia and, and sort of Singapore, um, we were, weren't as aware as, say, American-born sort of Chinese or, or, or Koreans or Asians, any any Asians for that matter, because there was a real struggle. There was like, there's nothing on television that people could relate to. Mm. Um, but for us, at least, we had sort of had the local content. But for cinema, I think it was, I, I don't know, it was just like all these wacky characters. I just remember Bruce Lee as Kato in the, you know, the, the Green Hornet back in the day. And, and that was that. definitely like the first sort of Asian that, that I recognize and sort of realize. 